Cars are most definitely getting smarter. Uh, what we see happening already is that cars are actually getting now connected to the network and real-time services are being made available to drivers. Things like location-based services that share traffic information. In some cases, you might even want to get your stock updates while you're driving down the road. I think the world is changing in terms of consumers' expectations to always be connected, always be informed, and always have access really to web-based information. But there is a class of consumer known as the digital native. These are people who were born after 1980 and whose lives have always been saturated with technology. Generally speaking, they know how to use it better than most of us. They like it and they always want to have access to it. This audience now makes up about 40% of the car buying audience in the United States, similar percentages in other parts of the world. So it's an audience that the car makers are very interested in finding out how they can appeal to. The buying habits of young people also tend to be slightly different. Um, as example, there are new ideas emerging around ideas like car sharing. Um, this is somewhat of a unique idea and tends to be used more by the young than by others. So in those instances, what's also going to be important to the automaker is to figure out how they can um, move the experience from car to car potentially with the consumer. Now that's an interesting challenge for a car maker who wants to continue to attract a buyer to their own brand, has to figure out how to deal with.